And it was at this moment he knew he fucked up. <laughs> Hi, how are you guys doing? And welcome back to Catherine Full Body with me, Girl No Fuses. Uh, last time we went through some puzzles, barely survived, talked to all the sheep, and now we're about to go in confession booth. And I think we're about to go against a boss this time, but we'll see. Will you say the same thing like before? Uh, hey. I told you, sit down first. <laughs> he sounds he sounds so impatient. He's like, if I have to repeat this every time. Oh, You're here, Lost Lamb. Next question. What do you value? I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. Not to mention, you have more than one path ahead of you. <laughs> this is the second question. Does what was that goofy laugh he just did? With marriage? Okay. Again, I'm gonna keep reminding y'all. We're trying to have no morals. We're trying to be evil. So we're gonna have to go and say life ends. Yep, back into the red. All right, cool. Slowly but surely. Your selection. I knew it. This is actually you a giant it. chapel with eight floors. Wait, does that mean there's an end to this? The world is in a state of flux. I won't be able to guarantee what your future holds. Be careful what you take for granted. I'm sure you've heard the stories of people losing such things. Something big is coming. I can feel it. Something the likes of which this world has never seen. <sighs> okay, that's I guess ominous. there's no point in worrying about the future. You have more pressing matters to attend to. <laughs> Are you ready? No. I like that laugh. So what the hell's going on here? Okay, let's see what the people said. Life begins. That's all first timers. Men only. Life begins. Women only. Life begins. Oh, you guys are so nice. <laughs> I want to say that every time, too. Unnatural cause. What is unnatural causes? You won't escape. Huh? What? It's a voice. Where have I? I won't let you escape. What the hell is this? Catherine? The fists of Grudge have appeared. Right, it's the it. killer. Do not die. Aw, oh, dang it. Undo. Edge. Edge. No! I do not believe this. Edge. I did it again! Okay. Just don't even go for the coins, like... Jeez. Already, I'm messing up. Right, I got it. Right, I got it. Oh, use a bell, all nearby blocks will be converted into normal white blocks. Okay. This is handy for getting rid of tricky obstacles, such as cracked blocks or immovable blocks. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> Oh 
my god, I'm gonna do this. Oh no! Undo. Undo. Oh my, ladies and gentlemen. Undo. We have a problem. Gonna get out of here. Undo. Oh my god. I'm gonna use this. Undo. Oh my I am so I am so dead. I'm so dead. Edge. Yep, please. Edge. What why'd you do that? Edge. 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 Alright, right, I got it. This. Right. Oh, that's so scary. That was a very scary sound you just made. How's this? Are you having trouble? Okay. Remember, you can always go back and undo some of the moves. Undo. Undo. Oh my god. Oh, a checkpoint. I really need that checkpoint. This has to be a bronze. I'm just thinking of the Catherine version, like, no mercy, you die once or twice and get bronze. You have escaped from the prison of despair. That's so, bronze. And I bet money I'm gonna get bronze every level. I have something special to show you tonight. Think back you do? to long ago. Back to a time when you felt happy. Five years Sorry, ago, I'm having flashbacks? I don't usually burn the bacon like that. It's all right, I don't mind it a little crispy. I can tell something's going on with you. Are you working too hard? <laughs> no, I'm fine. You've been gaining weight, haven't you? Can't forget to eat your veggies. Well, I put ketchup on almost everything. <laughs> that doesn't count. You know what? <laughs> hey! 
<laughs> Maybe a little workout will burn out those extra calories. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. <laughs> what do you think? Fond memories, huh? You should think long and hard about what you have to lose. Let's do this again tomorrow. If you can survive, that is. I was not expecting that flashback at all. He's like, wait a minute. Oh. And it was at this moment he knew he fucked up. <laughs> Marriage is just a tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's supposed to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Thank goodness. Huh? We think alike. Oh! <laughs> she suddenly teleported next to you. tomorrow so I need to get home oh, oh. I had fun tonight oh, oh. you must like what you see <laughs> I'm not staring you're a bad I'm not staring. you taste like smoke <laughs> but I don't mind <laughs> you don't say His face is like, oh crap. What is it good? Well, uh, you know, hooking up after we just met. Jeez, what the hell am I saying? Hmm. Huh? Um, is this gonna be a problem? So, okay, I cheated on Catherine. This is bad. This is really, really bad. But I didn't make a move. She forced herself on me. Fuck, man. I drank way too much. <laughs> uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Huh? Oh. No. No. So, how do you feel about me? Huh? Oh, wow, um, I can't quite explain it. Uh, I feel odd. Hmm? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow, I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. So then, it was love at first sight? Huh? Ah! What? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess? Sorry! I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah, dentists get angry if you're late, too. Well, I wanted to stay with you a little longer. 
I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon. D hey, wait. I'm actually dating someone already. <sighs> this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. Ah, no mistake, buddy. Ah, you know what? It just hit me. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. Hot streaks? When the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. <sighs> Crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have? I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. If you're gonna whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no shit. <laughs> I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> Ouch. Well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pic. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <laughs> I am so fucked. He's just grinning at him now. He's like, uh-huh. Have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on. If you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Oh my anyway, god. <laughs> too freaked out about one night stand. Hey, are you paying attention? Listen, man. Huh. I never saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. Uh, if this girl was cute, you'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, because of you jerks, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies' man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Whoa, Erica. Okay, enough of that. <laughs> so have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them, or not. Which is it? <laughs> His face is like, uh. <laughs> what exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. My eye. Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I, I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. So just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. <laughs> 
She's like, you better tell me about this girl. She must be quite something for you to cheat on your soon-to-be fiance. Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. You're in hot water yourself, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha, ha, ha. Shut up. I'm done fooling around. Oh, by the way, Ren's gonna play the piano here starting today. Oh, so her her name's Rin. Ah, she's so cute. Few days ago. Hurry, get up! It's coming for me. That? nobody rushing outside to hear this. Does nobody feel the tremors of giant footsteps? Uh, you okay? Hello? Do you know where you are? Okay, never mind that. Uh, how about a name? Uh, uh, Rin. Rin? Uh, that's a nice name. Uh, who is that though? So she just got amnesia at that very moment? Yeah. What was that? Amateur hour. Oh, don't say that. Rin's working really hard. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Oh, it was... Uh... <laughs> They're like, eee! Yeah, it was great. Really, uh, unique. Thank you so much. I was hoping to play a little better than that, but... Don't worry about it. No one gets things perfect the first time around. I guess you're right. I'll have to keep practicing. Yeah, if the bar doesn't go out of business by then. God! Well, I'll see you later. See ya. <laughs> well, nobody's perfect. I mean, <laughs> if she's that cute, who cares, right? <laughs> What's up with you anyway? Saving some cute girl from a stalker in the streets? Sounds like a daytime soap opera. That stuff doesn't really happen. Well, it did, so give it a rest. Does that girl <laughs> really have amnesia? Erica, you took her to the doctor, right? Did they find anything? Not really. They think it's only temporary. But it must be hard when the only thing you remember is wanting to play piano. Hey, so are you two really neighbors now? Yeah, the last guy just happened to move out. You better keep your hands off her. <laughs> oh, shut up. It's not like that. I, I'm an old man over here. But you guys really came through for us. You know it. Having Rin work here was a great idea, huh? We have you guys and even a police officer as customers. Not to mention, public spaces are a lot safer if she's really being stalked by someone. Yeah. Spend some time at the bar. You can drink by pressing the square button. Or get up by pressing the circle button. You can open menus with the options button. You can change the puzzle type and difficulty of the game and config. Nah, I'm good with normal remix mode. Let's get a drink. <sighs> when you drink, you can raise your intoxication level up to three times. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his nightmare. Okay, really? 
never cheated in my life before. Ren's gonna be fine. We'll keep an eye on her. What about you, though? Are you okay? That thing about men who cheat being cursed? Apparently, it's related to those mysterious deaths. You mean, like how Paul died? Yeah. Or it is. This is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah. He was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into him just the other day. Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault, man. Hmm? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Check my phone real quick. Any new messages? <sighs> Wait, I think I already got. Yeah, I've already gotten this one. Got that one. Congratulations. Fantastic news. Congratulations. You have successfully completed stage one. About the. About the movie function, you can view your past experience of the movie function. Oh, me! To all customers. When you spend time in the stray sheet, you will receive tenants on your phone. You can even reply to some of these messages. Depending how you reply, a business feelings and those of the person he is writing to may change. <sighs> it says continued. Oh, that's why. <laughs> to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? Oh, uh, sorry for staring. <laughs> Please sit. Have you ever heard this story before? The, the man, man who climbs, climbs the highest mountain gets his every wish granted. What's that? It said a man climbed that mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do with as he pleases. Is this a fairy tale or something? These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. A prince who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you gain? Huh? Will you become the man of legends? Of course. You got a mail. <laughs> but I think these two might be psychic. And if you don't know, uh, they were in also in the original Catherine as well. And I still and I believe that they were very psychic. Or they had something to do with that world. But I just really think they're psychic. Oh, that's another one. Congratulations, you beat stage two. <laughs> Thanks for everything, Vincent. I'll get to see everyone here each night. And I'm really excited to play the piano at a place with such an adorable name like the Stray Sheep. Uh, don't thank me, thank Erica. Oh, no, wait, actually, it was Boss who hired you. Um, so I heard that. You're getting married? Well, I don't know about that. We have been together quite a while, though. I see. <laughs> Why do you sound disappointed? Hey, Rin, do you have any idea who was chasing you? No, not really. It was all so sudden. But everything's calmed down now, so it's fine. Uh, I guess. Well, we're all here for you, so let us know if you need anything. Can I not talk to Erica? Okay, I can. I wonder who the stalker was. Rin doesn't seem worried, but you can never be too careful. Well, if shit hits the fan, you'll protect her, right? It's your problem, too? Seriously. Anyway, you a cheater? Who would have thought? Don't you care about Catherine? Uh, of course, but I feel like I wasn't even involved with it. Well, you were. I hate to be so confrontational, but... Jeez. 
Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor's real, what are you gonna do? Nothing, because it's not real. Uh, if you say so. Catherine started dating you because she just couldn't leave you alone. You're stupid in all the right ways. It tickles her maternal instincts. A dominant, independent personality like hers is usually attracted to minds like yours. Is that the way it is? Look at these plushies. Wait a minute. Is that... You see that? You see that right there? That's the little, um... That's Morgana. That's Morgana from, from Persona 5. You see the little plushie? Oh my god. I can't believe I caught that. Oh, it's so cute. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy. Always climbing. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Oh, very, very heard all that. Wait, can I sit? Time will slowly pass each time you sit and talk to people. Have fun with the other bar patrons. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. Some customers are experiencing difficulties. Try to cheer them up when you can. You can go home at any time from the door in the front. Perhaps it wasn't the best idea to hire a musician for her looks. It's just that when I saw her, I felt an arrow pierce my heart. It's oh my god. You run this place into the ground. <clears throat> anyway, have you seen the news recently? It's nothing but stories about those deaths. They said that there are several people who've died in the same fashion. Erica says that people believe it's a curse given when a woman is scorned by an unfaithful man. A grown man talking about curses? It just ignore Erica. A woman's guess is much more accurate than a man's certainty. To pitch a phrase from a certain someone. You don't think it applies to Erica? Then there's nothing to worry about. Erica's guesses are never on target. By the way, you look a bit glum. Hey boss, you uh, you ever cheated on someone? My, my, my. It's not like that. It was an unintentional event. Unintentional? Are you sure about that? Mm, I can't tell which one would give me the red, the red answer. I'm going to say I don't remember. I'll yes. Tell you the truth, I can't really remember. Did you have too much to drink? Oh my. Besides, I heard you were wearing those shades to hide from an ex-girlfriend. To a man, it may be a one-night stand, but to a woman, it is the beginning of a lifetime. And to borrow a line from a certain someone. Anyway, it is a strange rumor. Both of us should be careful. You got a mail. Are you at the stray sheep again? Uh oh. Are you are you drinking again? I stopped by a perm today, but you weren't there. I want to talk to you about something, but I guess it'll have to wait. Until tomorrow. By the way, your place is filthy. I told you guys to empty the trash more often. I took it out this time, but you need to be more careful, okay? That's all. Good night. Bad time, I guess. I can drink if I want. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's start tomorrow. Sorry, I'm too tired to talk right now. Yep. Good night. <laughs> Later. Man, I'm tired. Let's say good night. Yes. Alright guys, well it looks like I ran out of time for this video. Hope you enjoyed it and if you did, then don't hesitate to destroy that like and subscribe button. In the next video, we're mostly going to talk to everybody else and see what's going on in this bar. And we're going to head off into Nightmare Land. I'll see you then. Bye!